Over the past five years, 150,000 elephants have been killed. These amusing animals have helped people in many different ways. And today I'm going to talk to you about some basic background information about elephants, two famous elephants, the similarities they have to humans, and why people are killing them. So just some basic information is today there are two species of elephants, the African elephant and the Asian elephant. And thousands of years ago, there used to be 350 distinct species. The African elephant is slightly bigger than the Asian elephant, and they are Earth's largest land animal. Now I'm going to talk to you about the elephant's ears. Mm -hmm. the air, they use their ears to help keep them cool. They use them as a giant fan to <laughs> blow air on them. And then they also use their ears to help regulate their body temperature. And they use them to hear sounds from far away so they can hear danger coming or another elephant that's in distress. And they also use them to communicate by moving their ears in different ways. And in this picture, you can see that the African elephant, his ears are slightly bigger than the Asian elephants. Now I'm gonna to talk to you about their trunks. And this is a video of a baby elephant learning to use her trunk. Their trunk contains over 500 muscles and tendons to make it extremely flexible, and their trunk is basically just a long nose that has many different function functions, which is breathing, smelling, and drinking. And just how we use our fingers, that's how an elephant uses their trunk. And they use them to dig up roots, strip bark off of trees, and to occasionally they fight each other. And they also use it to smell danger from far away. And they also use their trunk to spray water on them to help keep them cool. This is just a picture of each, each kind of elephant's trunk. Now I'm going to talk to you about where they live. According to Edmund Rogers, he states in his book Elephants that the African elephant lives in the sub-Saharan Africa. They also live in the rainforest of Central and West Africa in the Sahel Desert in Mali. This is just a picture of Central Africa and then the one on the left is West Africa. Asian elephants, they live in Nepal and India, and they also live in the scrub forest and rainforest of Southeast Asia. Now I'm going to talk to you about two famous elephants. According to HistoryList.com, Jumbo the elephant is one of the most famous element, elephants ever to be known. He was first captured by a tribe of hunters in 1861, and later was purchased by an animal collector. His name Jumbo is a combination of the Swahili word that means chief, and his name Jumbo means hello. In 1865, Jumbo was traded to the Royal Zoological Society in London. In 1880, a park supervisor, Matthew Scott, saw hope for Jumbo and he added him to the circus called The Greatest Show on Earth. He traveled with the circus all through the United States and Canada. When the circus got to St. Thomas, Ontario, Canada, Matthew Scott was leading Jumbo and another circus elephant, Tom Thumb, who was a clown elephant, down the railroad tracks. And that's when tragedy hit. A popular version of the story is that an unscheduled train was coming down the tracks and Tom and Jumbo pushed Tom Thumb out of the way and let himself get hit. And as he was dying, he pulled Matthew Scott, pulled him in close with his trunk as he was dying. And this is just a picture after Jumbo died. Now I'm going to talk to you about Lin Wong. Lin Wong was a World War II veteran who was one of seven elephants who survived the war. He is now the national symbol of Taiwan name is Forest King. Later, he was donated to a city zoo in Taiwan where he became a very popular attraction, and later in 2003, he died at age 86. Now I'm going to talk to you about some characteristics elephants have in common with humans. According to the book Our Wildlife World by Ellen Kelsey, she states that elephants have many of the same emotions as humans, such as grief, love, sympathy, and joy. They have same of the social behaviors as humans also. Baby elephants have even been known and caught on camera to throw temper tantrums when they don't have their way. And they can also be flirtatious and argue about directions just like any couple would. 
They even share the same lifespan with us. They also show similar family characteristics. They are very fond of their families or herds, just how we are fond of our families and loved ones. They have even been caught on camera showing that when one of their family or her members dies, they gather around and mourn over their lost family member. And this is just a picture of a little bit showing affection. Mm -hmm. information, some basic information, 